What is that with my hair? That's just gonna have to do. It's gonna annoy me though. Hey guys, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. I am filming a video today. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while. I don't have an excuse. I said in the last video I was back, then everything happened. <laughs> my car got written off. <laughs> so yeah, I've been focusing on finding a new car and everything and I've got one. So if you'd like a story time as to the car being written off or like a new car tour or something, then let me know in the comments. But yeah, that's for another time. Um, anyway, I'm back with another video as you can see and I thought it would be relevant for me to do a little mix Q&A because I am seeing them this weekend so by the time you're watching this I would have seen them already the day before and yeah I just thought it'd be relevant because I'm literally so excited I've had these tickets since way before lockdown and obviously lockdown stopped it from happening and it is their last tour so it's going to be quite emotional um but yeah so I thought it'd be relevant to do uh, the little mix Q and A, um, and yeah. So with that, I'm going to jump straight into the questions. And yeah, if you are a little mix fan, let me know. And if you want to answer these questions down in the comments below, or if you want to like, I don't know, do this as a video on your channel, please go ahead. But let me know that you've done it so I can go watch it. And yeah, if you've also been to watch them on tour, then are you due to watch them on tour? Let me know in the comments as well and tell me where you've seen them, are you going to see them? And yeah, so we are going to get on with the video. So we are going to go straight in with the horrible question and that is least favourite song. So I don't actually know. I mean, I'm not a massive fan, like I'm more of a fan of The Wanted than I am of Little Mix. Everyone's going to judge me for this one, but I'm not like a massive fan of Joan of Arc. I don't know, it just... I just can't, I don't know, there's just something about it that I'm not a massive fan of. So yeah, I'm going to have to go with Joan of Arc. I literally have no reason whatsoever why, but yeah. I think also the lyrics just don't stick with me. Um, I don't know why. It's just, just one of them songs that I just can't like, I don't know. It's just something about it that I can't really put my finger on. But yeah, Joan of Arc has got to be my least favourite song. Then it moves on to favourite song. So my favourite song has got to be, I'm stuck between two. So the first one is The Cure, um, just because of the lyrics in it. And also the second one is Secret Love Song, just because it's got a powerful message behind it. And yeah, I just love them two songs so much. And I think basically them two songs have really powerful messages around, behind them. And I think like, Everybody can relate to them, so yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so I just thought, because of the world that we're in, everybody can relate to them, whether it be for yourself, a friend, a family, somebody you know, or whatever. Everybody can relate to them, and I think the words just mean quite a lot. And yeah, so that is my two favourite songs. I can't pick one, but yeah, there they are. So this one says, who was the first member to follow you on Twitter? Now, I know that they only have a band account as far as I'm aware. Like I said, I'm not a massive fan. Yeah, as far as I'm aware, they only have a band account and it doesn't follow me, so <laughs> never. <laughs> Probably never will as well. Um, but yeah, so that's the answer to that one. When was your first Little Mix concert? I'm pretty sure I saw them at X Factor tour when they were on X Factor. I'm pretty sure that was then. I can't remember when that was. Let me see if I can find a video. Okay, I don't think I have a video of them. But yeah, I'm pretty sure it was when they first did the X Factor tour, when they were on X Factor. I can't remember how many years ago that was, but that was the first time I saw them. Have you met any of them? No, but I would love to meet them so much. Like, they just seem like such fun people to be around, and yeah, it would just be amazing. Like, especially, I don't know, I just, I just, there's something about them that I can relate to, and yeah, I just think it'd be so much fun if I could meet them and hang out with them for the day, you know, just to get to know them rather than, no pictures, no videos, just like, yeah. I think it'd just be super cool. Like, if you have met them, let me know in the comments because I think they'd just be so chilled and like, just down to earth. That's what they come across anyway, so yeah. How long have you been a fan? I've been a fan since, to be fair, I could potentially be a hardcore fan because of this, 
but I'm not because I don't know like the ins and outs and I don't follow them around but I have technically been a fan since they were on X Factor because I just thought they were absolutely amazing but I was a fan, I've been a fan of them I listen to all the music, download the music but I've hardly seen them on tour like the first time I saw them since X Factor was literally like probably just before lockdown um, and yeah I don't know why I've not been to one since it's, just, it's such a good show but yeah, I'm not like a hardcore fan in the sense of I don't follow them around. But I've been a fan since X Factor, if that makes sense. <laughs> Would you get any tattoos of Little Mix? And probably not. I'm not like a tattoo person as it is. I don't if I did to get if I did get a tattoo, I wouldn't even know what it would have been of. I don't know. Maybe like the lyric wings are made to fly. I'm not sure. This is such a boring video, isn't it? Because I've hardly got any good answers. Like if I did this for the wanted then I'd have so many good answers. Which member is your favourite and why? Oh, this one's hard. Like, before everything happened with Jessie and before she left and everything, I would have said Jessie, but now I don't know. Like, Perry and Jade make me laugh so much, but then Leanne's just so funny. Like, she's genuinely funny. She's, like, accident prone like I am. I don't know. They just... All of them, I think, gel really well together. So I feel like I don't have a favourite, if that makes sense. Like, yeah, I don't know, they just, just all as one. Like, it's really hard to pick a favourite because they all just, they're just all so funny as it is and they all, like, seem really kind and down to earth and everything. Um, I don't know, maybe if I had to pick one. Oh, this is so hard. If I had to pick one, it'd be, I think it'd be Jade. I don't know. I just, oh, this is so bad, like... I love them all, they're just like, they're so funny in different ways. But if you made me pick one, I'd say Jade. But then Perry and Leanna said, so oh, I don't know, guys, it's so hard. Yeah, we're just gonna go to the next question. <laughs> Have you ever interacted with any of the members online or in person? I've tweeted them a few times, but never like, had anything back. And I've never met them in person, so yeah. It says if you have, which was your favourite interaction, but obviously I've not had any, so yeah. Have you been to one of the concerts before and are you going to any anytime soon? And yes, I went to one of their concerts. What year was it? Let me see if I can find when it was. Because it was before lockdown, so it would have been ages ago now. That must have took me about 20 minutes just to find. It was in 2019, I couldn't tell you what month, but I have found the year, so that is amazing. But yeah, and then the next one is Saturday. So the day before you watch this, I would have been to see Little Mix again. I'm so excited. Um, in Manchester. I'm so excited about that. Can't wait. It's such a good vibe, like honestly. What are your favourite lyrics? Ooh, that is a good one. It's got a... I probably would say what I would have as the tattoo, which is these wings are made to fly. And it's probably just because it's like... The message to me anyway, it tells you like just to go out there and try new things. And like these wings were made to fly. You were meant to, made to go and do these things. Like, yeah, I don't know. It's just like quite an outgoing like lyric. I don't really know how to describe it. But yeah, it's kind of like saying just... Don't let anything hold you back. Just go for it kind of thing. Like the wings were made to fly. You were made to try these things kind of thing. If that makes sense. Like I don't know. That's just kind of how it comes across to me. Um, and it's like. But these wings were made to fly. Just do it kind of thing. If that makes sense. But yeah. I probably just have to go with that lyric. Just because that one's kind of the one that sticks out to me. And yeah. What is your favourite music video? Not gonna lie. I don't think I've ever watched them. I told you I'm not a hardcore Little Mix fan, but I just thought this video would be fun and then like it's probably turned so boring now. Um, let's see. I actually do like Black Magic because it's quite a fun video. Favourite song to hit live and that has got to be Secret Love Song. It's just so powerful and like you can tell it means something to the girls um, and also the audience. And I think it's just very powerful, especially like it's 2022 and these things just need to get normalized but yeah i just think it's so good live like the vocals and everything is just really good obviously i don't know how it's going to sound um as with them as a three piece because I, I heard it when jesse was still in the band 
but obviously I think it's still going to sound just as good. Um, but I think that it's just absolutely amazing to listen to live and yeah it's just like the vocals are just so amazing like I don't know how they can get so high and so powerful it's actually insane so yeah I think that um the best song to hear live is um secret love song so that is it that is all of the questions that I have to answer if you it'd be so cool to hear what your like answers are to these questions they're probably more interested than mine but I just thought it'd be such a fun video to do just because Obviously, I'm seeing them this weekend. Well, yesterday for you guys when this video goes up, like I said, plenty of times. Um, but yeah, I just thought it'd be so cool to do this little video. And I will be vlogging it on my vlogging channel as well. So make sure you are subscribed to that channel and check out the vlog. It'll probably be out a few days after this video. And yeah, yeah, I got so American then. Um, and yeah. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to play along, answer the questions down below in the comments. That'd be so cool to see your answers to these questions. Um, and also, like I said, let me know if you've seen them live down in the comments below. And yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. It was probably quite boring, but I just thought it'd be fun to do. And yeah, I'm so gutted that this is the last tour because their tours are just so much fun. Like, yeah. <laughs> but yeah thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it even though i think it's pretty boring but you know hey hey um and yeah thank you so much for watching and make sure you hit that thumbs up button if you made it to the end and you enjoyed it um i'm thinking of maybe doing some more videos like this for other artists that i've seen live and i'm a fan of and yeah and also hit that subscribe button if you are new so yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week with another video. Bye.